he's very warm it's 34 35 degrees so we got a nice hot cup of tea i know um but i had to turn my fan off because it makes a noise so. yeah we've noticed the fan on in the background yeah. the, the microphone really picks it up loud so what's this week's video about Maud? we are actually on our way back from bedford as you know um it's the return journey and we've just left barford great Old, mills old mills old mills yeah. um on our way towards um hartford towards hartford marine yeah. yeah we stop off at quite a few moorings on the way back but we didn't want to bore you with those because we did them on the way there as i was going to say <laughs> <laughs> i got in there but the re the reason we're going to hartford marina on the way down when we visited St Ives on the way you, to Bedford yeah you've yeah. seen that in a few videos back um it was moored up walking into town one day and we saw what we thought was <laughs> a woman trapped in her car frantically trying to get out she was she she looked very distressed yeah, waving distressed and, and trying to open the windows pointing to the window <laughs> pointing to the door at this i was ready to run but at this point debbie recognized i recognized her. it's a viewer of ours who tracy debbie had actually friended on facebook um tracy had been sat in the car ignition off obviously we've walked along <laughs> she wanted to speak to us and the windows wouldn't open. She eventually twigged if she turned the ignition back on. She could open yeah. the window. Yeah, yeah. But, bless her. Um, yeah, she had a little um, invite for us. Yes. Yeah, at some point on one of the social media platforms, I must have mentioned that I wanted, wanted to have a go at canoeing or paddleboarding. Yeah, yeah. And it just it turns out her and her partner, Craig, run a paddleboarding kayak canoeing business in Hartford Marina. Yeah. So unfortunately we couldn't go then because we was on our way down to bedford but we yeah, said we would something happened where where we we couldn't i don't know whether it was weather or or something yeah so we said we'd catch him on the rebound yeah yeah so uh we're now going into uh hartford marina i keep going to call it hatfield marina for some reason hartford, hartford marina we'll meet when we get in there On the return leg from Bedford. Yep. Haven't done much filming on the return leg. I should really um, give a different perspective. Um, but we're off to it today, Deborah. We're going to pop into Hartford Marina to see Craig and Tracy, and Mark's going to have a go on a paddle I might, board. I might, I might do. Yeah, Deb wants me to. I want him to have a go. He wants to go on a paddle board, <laughs> or he wants to buy a paddle board. Yeah. Well, we had this discussion. All, all we've seen the last few weeks, the weather's been nice. Every evening, canoes, kayaks, paddle boards coming past. Um, I said I'm going to get a paddle board. Deb's convinced I won't get a stand up on one. Me being a natural athlete, and I had a skateboard when I was 13, which was not many years ago. And uh, I only fell off the grandson skateboard once. So I, I think I'll nail it, but we shall find out. Watch this space. Yeah. And um, we've been told there's a, a pub in the marina yeah, yeah hartford but, hartford mills yeah so, so with um moorings there so we'll get moored up there for a meal i think yeah. that's the turning yeah deb's yeah. now going to take it into the marina okay sugar
Here's our water taxi coming, Deborah. <laughs> oh. Was that what you was expecting, Deb? Oh, she's pleased. Oh, she? She's pleased. We've got a we've got Hello, a guest mate. on the boat. <laughs> Big ones. Right. Um. <laughs> it's Archie's gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you. You're very welcome. It's happy. She's made a new friend. Archie. So you're going to come on a ki kayak with me? No. You're going to dog sit? Yes. Okay. I'll dog sit. Right, where are we, Deb? We are at Hartford Marina, go paddle. Yeah, um... If ever you're around this way, yeah, give them a try. Um, Craig here, the owner, um, got various paddle boards, kayaks and that, and I'm now going to attempt paddle boarding. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> and I'll talk you through later all their prices and bits and pieces, and uh, I'll give you the address and I'll put that in the link below. I'm nervous. <laughs> <laughs> so get all of your paddle in the water, when you're down on your knees, tick it down like this. That's all you need. As soon as you pass your leg, there's nothing there now. Alright. Grab on that a moment. Well, this is easier than I thought. <laughs> Do it yet, you're out in the middle, oh, and then right, literally yeah. bring your bum up, yeah, and then bring yourself and keep your weight central. So, take yourself paddle and to the center. Put some effort in there, but I've got a bad feeling about this. <laughs> take it, yeah, slow down. That's it, go on, steady. Straight up, straight your legs and straight your back. Up, 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 up. That's it. Don't lean so much. That's it. That's it. Take control. You're in control. You're doing it. Going. You're doing it. Steady. You said there's a wind there. You're doing really well. So you're going to be a stunt man? Where it's worn. Feet on the side of that? Yes. He says I'm bored now. Look at that, he's even got a bow wave. Ready. Yeah, so we decided we, we'd have an overnight stay at Hartford Marina. Um, we had a lovely meal with uh, Craig and Tracy. Thank you very much. Um, and then Mark had his paddleboard experience. Yeah, um, pleasantly surprised by the outcome that I managed to stay stay upright. He did. Um, it is it is quite hard. It is it's weird. It's like a from the what's, it's like an all over workout. You you need that core strength, which naturally I have. Um, <laughs> but. My toes and machines afterwards. You seem seem to grip on with your toes, and there's a lot of the, those muscles in the shins. I don't think I've ever worked those out before. Yeah. Yeah, but 
Now two different types of paddleboard and went on a smaller rigid one first and then progressed to the stunt board. Now <laughs> I went on a, uh, it was like a rigid foam board which, which was actually more, st felt to me more stable than the rigid plastic ones. But just, now just, had a, can we just stop there for a second? There's a lady. Who's that lady looking in this? I don't know. Is she looking in? Or is she looking over? Yeah. We've got, we've got a lady standing there with her arms crossed, glaring yeah, in the window, but the, she's about 20 know. feet away, so I don't know whether she's actually looking at us or. Right, I don't know where I was up to. But there was a heron, a, was a heron just outside our window, window and fishing. <laughs> oh, we fantastic. couldn't see the heron, but the, yeah. the lady could, and she looked like she was literally looking in the window. So yeah, I just went out there. Oi! <laughs> <laughs> what are you looking at? <laughs> oh dear. Right. Yeah, paddle boarding. Yeah, paddle boarding's good. Yeah, Mark so loved thoroughly it. Thoroughly enjoyed it. The, the, the tuition instruction from Craig, yeah. simple, straightforward, good. I will add, um, part of their uh, their hire procedure, uh, life buoyancy aids, life vests or whatever they're called, that, that all goes with it. I was offered one of those, I declined, I didn't want it, and the, the water's very shallow in that part of the marina, I could have stood up just above waist height. Yeah. Yeah, so um, but normally obviously some wouldn't. of you will pick up on that, so that saves you commenting on the fact that I wasn't wearing a buoyancy aid. That was my own personal choice. Yeah. But I shall put all the, the details in the description below, links um, to Crazy, uh, Crazy, Tracy and Craig's um, website, Go Paddle, I think it's called. Yes, yeah. yeah, um, yeah. So you'll be able to uh, click on that or the telephone number ring those to sort they're out. They're great people, they really yeah. are. Yeah. yeah, every now and again you, you meet people and you, you just know you're going to be friends for life. Well yeah. that weren't one of those occasions unfortunately. <laughs> <laughs> he'll, he'll thump me he when, will. I, when he he's will. seeing me next. Yeah. No, no, really, really, really great no, they're couple. Lovely couple, yeah, yeah. And, and, nice, and hopefully nice... we will stay friends for a long yes, time. Yes, yeah. yeah, yeah, good three or four weeks. <laughs> Yeah, so we left there, moved next on. Next morning, yeah. Next morning, only a short cruise, just back to St Ives, um, where we first bumped into Tracy, and just waited there for the day for my Amazon parcel to be delivered, and then Craig was going to run that down in the yeah, evening. Yeah, which he did. Thank yeah. you very much, yeah. Craig. Yeah. Yet uh, yeah. again. And following morning, we set off, I forget where we ended up, somewhere near the... It was a Gober mooring anyway. Hopefully this next clip will... Tell you. tell you. Right, so just got moored up at the Pike and Eel Gober Moorings and I'm now going to unbox my latest toy. Depending on how I've edited the video, you probably, I think I'm going to edit it so you would have already seen what I'm now waffling on about the, the paddleboard. Um, managed to get one ordered through Amazon and um, Craig and Tracy let me have it delivered to their address at Hartford Marina. So they dropped it off to us last night. Been itching to get get on it all day. So I'm going to do a little bit of un unboxing just to show you what's in there. This is not a professional re uh, review or unboxing or anything like that. I'm just going to going to show you. Right. So one big cardboard box. Oh, it's coming. Hopefully, I got the camera set up so you'll be able to see everything. So it's a kit. Everything I'll need to do the paddle board. And the only thing I had to buy separately was a. Uh, uh, buoyancy vest um, which I've done that's a little repair kit um, some patches there's a spanner for the valve I possibly will be investing in an electric pump a lot of the reviews I've read these do take a bit of pumping up um, mind you I could do with the exercise pressure gauge on there because I think these are pumped up to about 14 and a half PSI. I remember when we had the caravan we used to have inflatable awnings and uh, they took some blowing up. Ankle strap. So if you fall off um, the board's not going to get away from you. There's a fin to go on the, the bottom. 
it's a carry bag rucksack type affair that, that should all fit in there's a three piece paddle it's like Christmas yeah so that's me paddle most importantly the paddleboard now the the variety of boards out there um, it, it does get a little bit mind-boggling um, I've gone for sort of an all-rounder board a beginner board it's 10 foot 6 long 32 inches wide and 6 inches deep um, and that is going to give me some sort of good stability so and this this at the time was um, I've put the actual name of the board and a link for this below uh, this was 249 pounds that was retailing at the time and they vary anywhere from 150 up to about 800 pound for these but I thought well my first one something lower end of the market just to get the feel for it if I'm going to enjoy it so let's get this bad boy pumped up Fifteen PSI. Right, all the gear, no idea. Got my little <laughs> waterproof case for my phone, so I can take my phone with me. Deb can see where I've drifted off to. I have got a GoPro that, that I can set up on the front, but I'm uh, more worried about just staying upright this time. Deb will get a little bit of footage of me going off, and uh, then I'll speak to you guys later. Right, here goes it. I was feeling very confident the other day, so just gonna set off on my knees, try and stand up. Oh mate, are you okay? So I float, my paddle floats. <laughs> um, loads of baby ducks come to laugh at me. So it's just got to practice a little bit more. See you later. Right, first impressions, well, apart from me taking my little tumble into the water, uh, knocking my confidence a bit, it's not as stable as the, the big rigid board that I went on um, 
the other day that you'd, you've seen the clip of. Yeah, but now very, very good, very, very stable. I only come off that once. Um, I've been a little bit more careful. Um, wind has just, just taken me there. I've got a big baggy t-shirt on. I'll be back to the boat in no time. No, I'm, I'm well pleased with it. It's um, it stayed up, has, hasn't gone down. Um, I'm getting quite a, quite a bit of a hoss on here. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. Getting up and down is the hard bit. I think that's how I fell off before. I'll have to uh, check the footage. I think when I went to go from the standing position down to the kneeling position, that's when the board will either go away that way or that way, just the same as a skateboard would. Um, but I'm gonna put my phone back in my waterproof case and go back to the boat. Deb's doing a nice roast dinner tonight. Yeah, so, well impressed. Like I say, there's loads, loads of them out there. Done a bit of research, narrowed it down to about two. This one was in stock. And uh, hopefully that's gonna last me a couple of seasons. As you can see, Mark had a wonderful time. Yes, yeah, obviously a little, bit, <laughs> a little, a little bit over confident. I, the uh, the video quality weren't as normal. No, because, because somebody is peeing herself. I was laughing, laughing so much. I, I ha in the end, I had to switch yeah. it off, pull myself together, and then turn it back on again. So I was more I'll, worried just... about losing good footage of me nearly drowning. Yeah, not the best swimmer in the world, but well, you had your buoyancy vest on. Yes, so yeah, was and all that's why. Right. My first experience of being submerged in the river. Yeah. I'm not a no, lover yeah. of the the weeds around my feet and bits and pieces. So but you handled it yes, very, very I, well. Yes, I did handle it yeah. very well. And, and, the, and you did go off for quite a while. Yeah, went off for about an hour. Um, yeah. Didn't come off anymore. Yeah. And I watched, did watch the footage back, and it was at that point where I tried to kneel down. Just done it too fast, and the board went from under me, hence my... Learned his lesson. Yeah, yeah, not too elegant entry into the water. Uh, and that, it was all done, and he's now a yeah, paddle but, Oh, oh, what an awesome little bit of kit. Yeah. Yeah, can't believe, once that's pumped up, and I'm not I'm not gonna, in, I think I mentioned I was gonna get a, an electric pump. I won't, it takes about five minutes to pump up. It is hard work, but again, it's a little bit of a, a workout, so, it's more and he doesn't actually I was going to say that you don't actually put it down every single time you pump it up no he'll leave it in the um, bring galley it over, bring it in overnight, overnight once it's dried off um, if especially if be, it's going to be good the next day yeah, yeah going to be used the next day yeah so. no point deflating it only to inflate it yes yeah, yeah but I shall leave um, links in the description below of the, the, the board that I got I think that's still available as we speak um, so you'll be able to check that out yeah. And again, links for anything else we've ever bought, used. It was bought with my own money, so yes. it wasn't a freebie yes. or anything, so <laughs> nobody needs to get offended. Or, well, hopefully you know. this week, no one will be offended, no, no one will no. write horrible things. Hopefully it's a very nice video, and everybody watches it, enjoys it, and just... Yeah, somebody be offended, about your fan or something, yeah, or your crucifix, or... Your parting's on the wrong side. I'm sure, sure somebody will find <laughs> find something. Shut up. Sorry. Right. So I think that's about it. Yeah. 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 Um, new supporters of the channel. Thank you yes. very much. Who have we got? We have got um, do, 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 do. Nick and Kathy Ekans. 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 Not sure if I've pronounced that right. And Barbara. That's over on Buy Me a Coffee that I've edited to Buy Me a Beer. Um, we've got, I'm not sure whether we've mentioned these before, Drew and Joan and Mike Meenkoth. 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 Um, over Corley. on Patreon and Karen Corley over on PayPal. Thank yes. you so, so much. Yes, thank you. And I, I want to. Oh, I want to tell them what's coming up. You can't. And oh, no, I can't. But we can't. We've got some expense involved in what's coming up, which I can't tell you about. But all all the the support that you give give us, that's all going to go we, yeah. towards that. And you're going to love it. I'm pretty sure you yeah, will. Yeah, yeah, we're going to yeah. love it anyway. We're so, going to. Yeah. <laughs> um, I've noticed my last few videos, 
all the supporters on all those different platforms, your name always go in the credits at the at the end of the video. For some reason, that's been missing. I've been adding the new names, but the whole list of names, once the video has been uploaded, has been gone. So hopefully I'll get that addressed in this week's video. So all you existing and previous uh, yeah. supporters of the channel, your names will be back up in the in the credits. Yes, so. and, and again, thank you so much for your support. Yeah, it's yeah. very much appreciated. And that is it. Yeah. Yes. So if you enjoyed this little video, press the like button. If you haven't already subscribed, press the subscribe button. If you want future notifications of any other videos we upload, the bell icon. And keep the comments co co comments coming. Comments. Yeah. yeah. What, comment? We love your comments, yeah. good or bad. We love them. <laughs> yeah. And we'll see you all next time. Bye.